You know, a little anecdote. A good friend of mine, uh, Jenny Conlon, who writes for the um, for the New York Times in the travel section, um, she's back living in Ann Arbor now with her husband Dan, and she did two articles in a row. They they started to travel into Detroit to meet some people, got involved in some organizations, and Jenny wrote two articles about the renaissance of Detroit and how it's become a real mecca for the younger generation, younger generations. Housing is so affordable. It's cool. Uh, these little neighborhoods, as mm -hmm. we know, are really cool. Right. So, you know, things like, for instance, take Avalon Bakery. There's a little neighborhood building yes. up around Avalon Bakery yes. to the point where now they're expanding. Um, Jenny wrote these two articles. They, the one, her first one was the most blogged article on a Sunday, so it runs in the Sunday section, right. of, in the history of blogging, if you will, for the New York Times. Oh, that's that one article on amazing. Detroit. Yeah. yeah. And now she's just got a grant um, to do uh, a thing called Crit Car, I think it is, or Crit Critic Car, which is essentially a traveling booth that allows you to walk right out of a show or a movie and rate it right there. So on a blog or, or tweet, right there so you might come out of a show mm -hmm. and it's going so she just got the funding about two or three weeks oh, ago really? she's a personal friend so here i'm giving her a plug i love it we'll have but, to have her on the show i but, love you know that. it's all about raising the awareness yeah. right so yeah. hey i just come out of the fox theater what right. a great place um saw this show fantastic got to see it boom you know it's this yeah. instantaneous getting out the, the good news about places. Right. I love to hear that. We'll yeah. have to do something with that. Damien Farrell from Damien Farrell Design Group here in Ann Arbor. He's an architect, and he's on the board of directors of the Michigan Architectural Foundation, uh, which is a resource to encourage future architectural professionals and policymakers. But it's a resource to all of us Absolutely. to appreciate architecture. Yes. Um, these tours that are given, the school effort the to reach out. programs. Right. right. All of the that tours, is right. part yeah, of all this. Of that. Yeah. Uh, the grants that have been set up. The grants too. that um, mm -hmm. um, to chapter grants for events. Uh, we gave out a grant um, for the um, oh, what's the the big art festival in um, Grand Rapids? Um, oh, for Art Prize. Yes, Art Prize. Mm -hmm. So that chapter put together sort of a, a place to go rest and to, and take you know put take a mm -hmm. little weight off and get a cup of coffee and in a lounge and there was an exhibition of some of mm -hmm. the work from this book um, and. So that's some of the stuff that we do. And see, you've got it open here at Alden Dow Studio. Yeah, Alden which, Dow. Uh, you know, another, another just unique, special man trained with Frank Lloyd Wright, his prairie style. He had such... Heir to a chemical oh, fortune. And, and uh, I've been in that studio. In fact, uh, they were one of two companies that uh, recruited me to come to this country. Mm -hmm. um, because I got to know Bill Gilmore, who was one of the former um, um, principals of the firm. So I spent some time in that studio. But, you know, he just, he really, he had the touch. Um, he, he got everything that Frank Lloyd Wright was trying to do. Now, and this home is up in Midland. This is up in Midland. That's actually his studio. Mm -hmm. So the house is off to the side, and that's um, now being preserved, I believe, and it's available for tours. and. Of course, he has one, I know, of one house here in Ann Arbor that he did. Um, but, you know, um, I, I had the, the pleasure of meeting him just before he passed away. Um, another grand, grand character, mm -hmm. grand man. Um, beautiful, just the gardens, you know. Uh, it, the house is seamless to the landscape, oh, it seems absolutely. like. Oh, absolutely. And the it's asymmetrical just, nature of everything yes, that is in yes. here as well. It's all about building and landscape. Yeah. yeah. There's every kind of architecture you can imagine. And this book is available for purchase on the website of the Michigan Architectural Foundation. Yes. It's about $70, I believe, somewhere mm -hmm. in that range. Mm -hmm. And there is a, it's very easy to find. There's a, there's a link right there. You can go right online. Mm -hmm. Uh, Visa, MasterCard, whatever you want, and uh, a few days later, you'll have a book in your hand. It is beautiful. Text by John Gallagher, and then the photographs by Balthazar Korob. And um, I'm so glad that you told us about this today. I'm going to really enjoy thumbing through this oh, I'm glad. and I'm reading glad. about all the beautiful spots throughout the entire yeah. state of Michigan. Yeah, no, I think it's it's something to be really proud of, um, and it's definitely worth having because it's you know here we are, a state. We're trying to fight back. We of building on our, our, our state pride, if you will. Mm -hmm. And I think a, a simple thing like this is really all about that.
I agree with you. Yeah. We started out talking about the Grand Hotel on Mackinac yeah. Island. Let's end with the Governor's, the Governor's Summer yeah. Residence. I have never been there, but I understand you have. I have. I've had the pleasure of being there um, on, for, on two occasions. Mm -hmm. And it's just a wonderful, you know, it's what those grand homes in northern Michigan are all about. Um, it's well preserved. It's... Uh, you know, beautiful wood floors. Yeah, it's, it's beautifully maintained and it's mm -hmm. just, the view is spectacular. It overlooks the jewel, the golf course. Um, it's, it's just around, if you will, around the slope from the Grand Hotel. One thing that strikes me by looking at these pictures is we have every kind of imaginable we do. architecture in we the do. state of Michigan. There isn't one kind of theme, is there? No, no we, we have, you know, um, all the way from uh, Kahn to Frank Lloyd Wright buildings to um, Contemporary architects like Graves, uh, Robert Stern. I mean, we, you know, I think people just are not aware of the fact that we, this state represents some, you know, I mean, you think of Cranbrook and the influence mm -hmm. of architecture, Saarinen's, mm -hmm. you know, from airport terminals down to little jewel homes um, that have been done by Franklin Wright. You know, there's a collection of them in Kalamazoo, for instance, and then we have the Palmer House right here in Ann Arbor. Right. So we really cover the gamut of architecture in the state um, right from the very early days um, up until very very contemporary work. Damien Farrell, architect with Damien Farrell Design Group on the Lucy Ann Lance Show each Saturday here on 1290 WLBY. Check out our YouTube of yes, our talk. We will put that up. YouTube, mm -hmm. but you go to youtube.com and when you get in there Google Damien Farrell or Lucy Ann Lance and these videos will come up courtesy of Jewel Ann Williams who is the wonderful person behind the video and the wonderful person behind Damien and his work life too. So I wouldn't say behind, I would say very much <laughs> out ahead. <laughs> there you go. What, what would we do without our wonderful assistants? Great Architecture of Michigan has been the theme today. What are we going to be doing on next week's show? We are uh, working right now very hard on women in architecture. Um, and um, there was a recent uh, gathering, an event that was centered around a short documentary of some of Frank Lloyd Wright's work. Mm -hmm. And so we have been in touch with some of those people. There's one person in particular who set up a fo her own foundation to um, promote women in architecture, women in design. Um, so we are working on that very hard. And so I'm hoping to um, have one of, the, one of, of that group on our show next week. Looking forward to it. Always yeah. fascinating talking mm -hmm. with Damon on these Saturday chats. You're listening to the Lucy Ann Lance Show on 1290 WLBY. My thanks to Damien Farrell. And my thanks to you always. <laughs>